come to you from a place of diseased immunity, which sounds a bit like the beginning of a post-apocalyptic show. Hello and welcome back to my channel. I have diseases, so I sound a bit like Barry White. I'm sorry about that. But I've been waiting to make this video for a few weeks. I thought if I don't do it now, then I'm not going to have the chance to do it until next week. So I'm just going to battle on and do it. The video in question is a Lush haul. If you don't know what Lush is, then where have you been? Lush is basically a, what's it called? A smelly stuff shop. They sell bath bombs, bath melts, shower gels, shower jellies, uh, cosmetics, uh, hand lotions, just stuff like that. And it's all cruelty free, it's all natural, and it all smells fucking amazing. Downside of it is, it's a little bit expensive. And also the shops are very, very hard to get round if you're in a wheelchair. I've yet to find a Lush shop that I can go in, in my wheelchair, which is a bit of a pain in the ass. But on the other hand, I like ordering the stuff online because then you can guarantee that no one's been pouring at it. So that's what I did. I decided to use some of my Christmas money to buy some stuff from Lush and I didn't just get one or two or three things. I got quite a few things. I spent about £50 the week before Christmas and I also got a few bits in the sale as well. It, it took me like 14 hours to get on the Lush website but I got there in the end. And I just wanted to show you what I got. I am aware it's after Christmas so you can't get a lot of this stuff now. But I couldn't afford to make it before Christmas and I've been ill and I've not been at home. What you find with a lot of the stuff is that even though it's Christmas, it's a Christmas exclusive, there are scents that are similar to that throughout the year. Um, and if I know of any of these then I will tell you. But other than that you're probably going to have to wait until next year. Or go on eBay and pay extortionate prices. Sorry about that. But I figured you might enjoy watching what I got. And it's a bit of a different video for me so I'm going to get started. Now the first thing I got is something that I've never bought before from Lush and that is a soap. I don't like soap, like bar soaps, because I figured all the germs just stay on them. However, I am moving into my own house soon, so I'm gonna have to have grown-up stuff like soap. And I thought, why not get nice, cool soap? Oh, by the way, all of my stuff is bagged up to keep it fresh, so that's why I've got all these sandwich bags. I saw this soap in the Christmas range, and I read the description of it, and I was like, well, that looks, that sounds amazing. And also, it looks really pretty. I've not got a very good chunk, because it's just pink. I think it was like all tie-dyed and cool, and pink and white. And this is Reindeer Rock. I really haven't thought this through because I haven't got much of a sense of smell. This is very similar to Snow Fairy, which is a lush scent that they bring out at Christmas that is, you either love it or hate it, and if you love it, you really, really love it. I am a big fan of Snow Fairy. It smells very much like Snow Fairy, which is um, a very, very sweet scent. It's like candy floss. That's the best way to describe it. It's like candy floss. I thought I was gonna get a better chunk than this, that's why I got it, because I wanted a really cool, pretty soap. But it smells nice enough. Oh, that's it. This isn't Reindeer Rock, you absolute... <laughs> so this is Rockstar. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. I thought it was called Reindeer Rock. It's not. It's called Rockstar. It's not a Christmas one, so if you want it, you can buy it. And it says, lather up our palm-free soap bases in your hands or use them straight on your body to wash and cleanse. Packed full of natural ingredients. These are also naked and self-preserving, making them both better for you and the environment. It's like Snow Fairy, what else can I say? I've said it all, but I've done it wrong now, so I'm off to a really good start. Something that definitely is a Christmas exclusive, and I know what it is called. This is called Golden Wonder. A wonder to blend. This is a bath bomb. I can't even smell it. See, I thought that this was like vanilla-y and almondy, but from what I can smell, it's kind of citrusy. I could be getting this all wrong. It's cool though, look at it, it's a present. This is gonna be a shit video. This I know, I know of what this is. This is called the wonder of Christmas. No, it's not, it's called the magic of Christmas. I'm doing shit. This is amazing, I love this. I had this last year and it is so pretty and very glittery. And basically it's a bubble bar on a cinnamon stick, it's got a little bell on it. And um, I think that is star anise if that's how you say it. Yeah, it's dried star anise. This is basically kind of uh, Christmas spices. Uh, you can see it's gold. It says to swirl it in the bath, but if you want to get the best out of it, 
uh, it's not as fun but you just cut a little bit off and hold it under the running water or just hold the bar under the water I don't like doing that because then the whole bar gets wet and it goes soggy and horrible so I tend to just cut off what I need this I remember was one of my favourites last year I got this in the sale as well if you like cinnamon and spicy things then you will really like that obviously because a lot of these are Christmassy there are a lot of Christmassy uh, spices um, let's show you something that isn't Christmassy I think sex bomb I think that's what it's called I've probably got it wrong no it's, it's, it's right sex bomb this is a bit damaged which is a bit annoying but it's still perfectly okay I can't smell it this is rubbish so, uh, look how pretty that is though now if I remember rightly I smelt these all last night this is very herby and floral. I don't know what herbs or florals. Florals? I don't know what herbs or flowers. Again, I don't think that is a Christmas exclusive, so if you want to get that and you can, I thought that was really pretty. I hadn't smelt it when I ordered it, so I did just get it for the pink prettiness. Again, this is a Christmas exclusive, and this was a new one this year. This is called Snowy. I got this for Sam, and it's a David Bowie bubble bar again this is herby and florally rather than the kind of sweet scents it's got a blue thing on the back of his head yeah this is this is very herb and florally it's a there's a little bit of rose in there i don't know something herby so that's if you like those kind of ones then if they bring it back next christmas um then buy it something else that i got again now this is a christmas exclusive but you can get a version of this uh, all year round this is butter bear and I got three of them because they were only 98p in the sale. And I got one for Lola, Sam's daughter, and two for me. It's just chocolate. It smells like chocolate. You can see it's a little bear. This is a bath bomb. Um, oh, fuck you. And it says a creamy vanilla scented bath bomb with cocoa butter to soften the skin. This is supposed to be really good if you've got eczema and dry skin. And I said, as I said, it was only 98p. And I thought, why not? And as I said, if you like the sound of that, you can get butterball all year round. Don't quote me on that. Another Christmas exclusive that I got three of. But I think this is Shoot for the Stars. As you can see, it's a blue bath bomb with gold stars. It's a little bit fruity. Vanilla, I think. Which I wouldn't be expecting. You think blue, you think it might be a little bit more um, not fruity. There's coconut, chocolate, a little bit of citrus. I think this turns your bath dark blue. This is Northern Lights. This is really cool because it spins around, sending out different colours, a bit like fireworks. I'm going to read you what it says. I can't smell it. This isn't a sweet scent. It spins around in the bath like that. Yeah, so it's a herbal one. Jasmine and ylang ylang. It's not my favourite smell, but I got it for like the novelty factor. This one, I, I presume it's a Christmas one. This is called Stardust and... If I remember correctly, this smells like chocolate and vanilla. And I think it makes your bath sparkly and white. Yeah, that's kind of chocolate and vanilla. <laughs> I just snorted a load of it. It's chocolate and vanilla and it smells nice. Again, I wouldn't have thought a white one would smell like that. I might be wrong. It might smell of shit. And my blocked up sinuses are just clouding my sense of smell. This is another Christmas exclusive. This comes out every year as far as I'm aware. This is a bath bomb and it is called, it's just called Father Christmas. So I wasn't, I wasn't too far on. This smells like Snow Fairy. So I really like this. I'll probably keep both of these for myself. So it's the vanilla uh, candy floss kind of smell. It's not as strong as Snow Fairy because that is very potent. If you smell the shower gel, you know that's very, very potent. Along the same lines as Snow Fairy, I have, this is my Snow Fairy bag. I didn't need to order any Snow Fairy shower gel this year because I've still got some from last year and I got some for Christmas anyway. So these are the Snow Fairy smelling stuff. This is Candy Mountain and it's basically a bubble bar. Look how pretty that is and it smells of Snow Fairy. I got two of those and I also got this. I love this. It's another one on a stick. This is called the Magic Wand and it's got silver glitter on it. They bring both of these out every year as far as I'm aware. This I got for Christmas from my mum and this is called... I have no idea how to spell that. Ceridwin's Cauldron, mate, or Keridwin's Cauldron. Keridwin's Cauldron Bath Melt. This is bath melt in a muslin cloth. And it's lovely, it's so pretty. And after you've melted it, after you've had it in the bath, you can use the muslin glove. 
This smells like lip service, which is a lip balm that I got for Sam last year, which we're both still using. That's another thing that are really good, the lush lip balms and lip scrubs. To me, it smells like apple juice. I don't know why, because there's no apple in it as far as I'm aware. So if you like the smell of apple juice, get it. This is a bath oil. This is called Razzle Dazzle. I don't know what it's supposed to smell like, but to me, it smells like Christmas trees. Certain it's not supposed to smell like Christmas trees. Cocoa butter, violet leaf. I don't know if that's what Christmas trees are made out of. Probably not, but that's what it smells like to me, and I really like it. I thought it was going to smell of rose. I don't know why, but I thought it was going to smell of rose. Another one that I got is... This is a Christmas exclusive. That one isn't a Christmas exclusive, I don't think. This is called Snow Melt. And again, it's a similar thing. So you melt them into, you drop them into your bath and they melt and it makes your skin all soft. This is a white sparkly one. I can't smell it. I can't even pretend to tell you what that smells like. Oh, there's peppermint in it. I don't like peppermint. I can't smell mint in it. I can smell something, but not mint. That's really helpful. That's, that pretty much sums up this video. I can smell something, but not mint. I could say that about all of them. This is the last Christmas one. There's only two more to go. This is the last Christmas one. And I know what this smells like because I smelt it last night and I was like, oh, what's that? These are the ruby red slippers. This is very strong. It's a spicy sort of cinnamon. I wasn't expecting that. I don't know what I thought they were going to smell like. How strange. This to me is really strongly spicy and has and cinnamony. There's no cinnamon in it. It's like a floral one. Yeah, it's like rose and tangerine oil. It just smells like cinnamon to me. I got these because I had used to have shoes like these. They were red sparkly glittery with a very high heel. I still have them actually, I just obviously can't wear them. And I got two of these because of the novelty factor. Now the last thing that I got, this isn't a Christmas exclusive, but it is limited edition and it's a charity one. And it's called Era 404. This was my favorite. This is like a little bit caramelly. It's gold, it's like an egg. And it says era 404 and then it's got like wires on the back i think and as i said it's a charity one so if you want to get it then get it whilst you can um because i don't think it's gonna be around for ages and oh i can use that for highlight now oh look pretty <laughs> so if you want to get that one then get it whilst you can that's my video thank you very much for watching i'm sorry i sound like shit. i'm sorry i look like shit, and i'm sorry i didn't really know much about what i was talking about but i just thought i'd show you what i got Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or comments, then leave them down below and I will see you again soon.